and we are joined now down by the locker room by a familiar face, and that is Randall Cobb. And Randall, let me be the first to say, welcome back, my friend. Man, I appreciate it. It's great to see you. Now take us through where you were and what the emotions were in you when you found out you were coming home. Those are your words. Yeah, well, you know, uh, it, this is it's a special place. It's a special place to come back to. And I was actually at the facility getting ready to run a conditioning test with the Texans, and I got a call, and it told me to come upstairs, and I knew what was going on. So uh, I'm just happy to, to be back and to finally be back in the green and gold and, and come here to do what we want to do. Oh, and they got you out of a conditioning test, too, to boot. <laughs> now, not too long ago, you were that 20-year-old fresh face coming into a locker room with Jordy Nelson, James Jones, Donald Driver looking to learn off of them, but now you're reacquainted to the Packer locker room as a grizzled vet. How have you embraced that role? I, I, I love it, man. You know, I got a, a really close friend in Amari Rogers that, you know, I've, I've known him since he was a kid. And the fact that I'm here and able to help him through this process is, is huge for me. It's huge for uh, his family and for both of us, uh, the connection that we have and, and all the other young guys in the room. We got a lot of great players in there. There's a lot of competition right now. We got a lot of people that's compete, compete, competing for spots and uh, I'm doing everything I can to help them out to put us in the best position to win. But you're not just here to teach. What are you looking to prove, if anything, out there on the field this year? Uh, that I can still play. You know, uh, I'll be 31 here in a couple of weeks and um, you know I, I feel like I still have something to give something to bring to this team and I'm excited to show that.